bastard who killed her raped her first. I think, I think the world needs to know that my sister was using a cheap gigolo. I think we're all capable of murder. You bastard! You want to murder her? You got it! She paid me, I gave her what she paid for. I was no more to her than a hairdresser or a manicure. Except you screwed up! You have no compassion, no respect for grief. Yeah? Well, that's great, considering how you've circled in your own mother's death like some kind of vulture. Bastard. I want to know why you never told us you were Sonia Kingsley's son. We're Sonia's children, aren't we? Why shouldn't we have it all? Is it a problem? I don't know. Oh, yeah. Yes. How do you sleep at night? He could inflame that madman. He's buying us time. Come on, he could be shot any minute. Why don't you do something? Shut up and let me get on with my job. Get me oh, done! <laughs> Someone has to keep this show on the road, you or me. The officer who was in charge of this operation was the very man who I exposed on this program yesterday. <laughs> One minute I feel fine, and then the next minute I feel like I'm going mad. I don't want people staring at me like I'm a freak, and I don't want us branded as a couple of dunks. As bins worked her ears in gay women. Oh, you stand there and try and pretend you're so liberal, but actually when you're staring homosexuality in the face, you can't handle it. You said you'd tell me what goes with you and Martin. He's my brother. You're running around like a bitch on heat. How long do you think it'll be before Trey finds out? He won't find out unless it happens to suit me. One of your wedding vows will be until death do us part. Isn't that why they invented hitmen? See this picture of your rich twin sister? <laughs> You've made yourself up to look like that chick in the paper, haven't you? What the hell are you playing at? None of your business. <laughs> now talk. Please. Do as they say or they'll kill me. Let her go. Look, you've got the wrong person. I'm Laura Harris. <laughs>